Thanks for joining us. I'm Liam Martin with the WBZ News Update. Let's take a look at our top stories now. Service shutdowns could impact your commute on the Blue Line. The new MBTA general manager announced the Blue Line will close for eight nights over the next month. The closures will allow crews to repair the tracks and eliminate slow zones. The first shutdown will begin next Monday. Boston police say they were forced to shoot two dogs, killing one of them at a family's home on Michigan Avenue. Investigators say the dogs attacked while they were making an arrest inside the house. The officer who was bitten was taken to the hospital for his injuries. A major health insurance company in Massachusetts is warning members about a recent cyber attack. The parent company of Harvard Pilgrim Healthcare and Tufts Health Plan says they were hit by a ransomware attack Monday. The company has taken its systems offline and they're working with a third party to investigate. Let's get a check of your next weather forecast now with meteorologist Zach Green. Hey Zach. Good morning Liam. Starting to thin out the clouds as we speak and the temperatures are going to be rising accordingly now that the blue sky is taking hold. Low 60s expected this afternoon. Bit of a breeze to come along with the end of the day, but nowhere near as apparent as what we get at Friday afternoon. So tomorrow morning, we're actually going to drape a little warm front right across us, nudging our temperatures up a bit, but then it's an onshore flow that's leading to a huge divide. Whether you're for interior locations, you have a better shot of seeing 70 degrees, so the warm-up definitely in store from the Berkshires to the Quabbin and maybe southern Worcester County, but we see this flow coming off of the water and that's going to allow us to only cap off into the 50s as we close in on the beaches. We'll begin to cloud things over on Saturday, so Friday thankfully is going to remain bone dry. So today into the low and mid 60s, tomorrow has a better shot of seeing the upper 60s again from central mass and western Massachusetts, but then we're only going to land into the upper 50s and low 60s around the beaches. So the silver lining here is that there isn't a raindrop in sight for the end of the week. Saturday is mainly dry too, so you got soccer games in the morning, plans in the afternoon, you're fine. Saturday evening may have a few showers in the mix. Sunday is a better chance of more scattered rain, and this is going to lead to a pretty good soaking across the area. So kind of a raw, dreary, cool way to wrap up your weekend plans. So for brunch or for tea time, unfortunately, it doesn't seem to be all that nice. Saturday would be the best chance to get outdoors. By Monday, we're still holding on to beneficial showers. We do need the rain at this point in the season. Liam will start to cap off those chances for Tuesday and Wednesday. All right, Zach, thank you. I'm Liam Martin. This has been a WBZ News Update. Have a great day, everybody.